Montessori Learning is back on in School District 57. Students and teachers from the High Glen Montessori program were back in class today after last Monday's fire which devastated the High Glen building. This old school has new life. For the first time in a decade, students arrived at Gladstone School for class. Montessori students are getting off the bus for the first day of school since last Monday's fire at High Glen. It's emotional for everyone. Highly emotional as you can expect. These children haven't seen each other in a week and the last time they saw each other for the most part was a pretty emotional time for them too because many of them did see the school when it was uh, on fire last week. So for today really lots of hugs, lots of happy smiling children coming together. Many students are being bused to the new school from High Glen until the end of the year. But keeping all the students in the school together was key for parents. Well, that was probably, you know, our first concern as a family, both her and mine, was, you know, what was going to happen, where would everyone go, would the school be split up to, you know, just to, ac to accommodate all the children in the school. So it's been, I think that's probably been the biggest ease on our minds, was knowing that the children could stay together. You know what's great is I think uh, that everybody was transferred. You know, it's the same teachers, same friends. But District staff worked extremely hard to get the building ready. Though Gladstone was maintained, work still needed to be done. Teachers came in on the weekend to get set for the arriving students. For everyone, parents, children, teachers, the worst part is the waiting, waiting to start the work again. And so today they're able to be in their classrooms. They were in on Sunday as well, able to get things set up. And the goal for everyone is to get things back to normal as quickly as possible for the students. The community came together to support families of High Glen students in the aftermath of the fire. Everybody was, was helpful and supportive and, and even, you know, just talked to Kennedy about it and asked about how she felt about it. Yeah, so it was really, really nice that everybody came together, for sure. The cause of the fire has yet to be determined. School officials don't know how long Gladstone will be the home for the Montessori program. Zamir Karim, CKPG News.